Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you the game between Petrov and Mordvinov. This is a correspondence game that was played in 1982. Petrov started with e4. Mordvinov played e5. Knight to f3, attacking the pawn on e5. And black didn't defend the pawn. Black played f5. Latvian counter gambit. Knight takes pawn on e5. Queen to f6, attacking the knight. d4, defending. d6, attacking the knight. And white played knight to c4, the correct move. It's better than knight to f3 because of pawn takes pawn on e4. So we have knight to c4. Pawn takes pawn on e4. Bishop to e2. c6. Perhaps the idea is to play d5. d5 immediately was a better move. We have c6. And now white played d5. Knight to e7. If pawn takes pawn on d5, queen takes pawn on d5, and black would have a weak pawn on d6. So we have knight to e7. Knight to c3. c takes on d5. And we have reached the most critical position of the game. It is white to move. What would you do in this position if you had white pieces? If you wish, you can pause the video and you can try to find the best move. Ready? What did you find? The move that comes to mind is knight takes pawn on d5. Not a bad move. After knight takes knight, queen takes knight. White is better. So knight takes on d5 is not a bad move. But white played a killer move. And that is knight takes pawn on e4. Black has a big problem. If, for example, pawn takes knight, then knight takes pawn on d6 check. And after king to d8, knight takes pawn on e4, this is check, and white is winning the queen. So black played queen to e6. It is white to move. White played a move and black resigned. What is the move? Black resigned. This is check. If king goes to d8, then knight to g5, attacking the queen. And after say, queen takes knight, knight to f7, check, family fork, winning the queen. What else? If after check, king goes to d7, then bishop. To g4 is winning. That is why in this position black resigned. And let's go back to critical position. What was your choice in this position? Was it knight takes pawn on d5 or knight takes pawn on e4? The killer move. And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess. And bye for now.